my Minecraft little series. Um, I did say that I was going to gather more wood or, and everything, but I said, I told myself that I'm going to do another episode. I'm going to, you know, do uh, my beginning stuff all on camera. Um, because really the beginning is what sets you up for everything. So uh, I'd much rather like, you know, cut out some of the mining stuff on camera rather than just do it off camera, you know? What if something fun happens? Um, like I gotta check up on my crop fields. <laughs> All right, let's take on this Enderman, everyone. Where did you go? No, I'm looking at like a tree. Where did the Enderman go? I was gonna kill it. Whatever. Okay, well, we're gonna make more aesthetically pleasing houses. Ooh, we could build a ship today. What should we build? I should do a poll someday. <laughs> what should I build next? Um, I'm gonna collect a lot of wood for the first half and then I'm just gonna go mining. Show you guys my mining techniques. So you guys can tell me what I need to do better. <laughs> or we could go to the nether. I don't think I'm ready though. Um, I also got to like start designing my bases. I, I got to stop like free handing, like freestyling everything. The village. That's what we need to do today. Go mining, get iron, go to the village and then make a, a little villager trading hall. That'll be a great thing to do in this episode. <laughs> um, yeah. Or I think boats would work, but I need at least one set of rails, or at least one set would be useful. Uh, and I don't know what design I want. I don't know if I want to do like a stone brick design. Ooh, what's this? Uh, I don't know if I want to do a stone brick design, which would require me, ah, cow, which would require me smelting a lot of um, bricks. Or if I should do more of a wooden design. I don't know. I can always change it as I go. Oh, really? I have like four crafting tables right now. And I don't need four. <laughs> um, there. Bye-bye, table. Yeah, so... A village trading hall. I think that would look great. You know, while I'm here at this cave, I might as well go down and try to explore to see if it has a lot of iron. Because this cave is massive. Massive. Why am I so bad at killing cows? Okay. Down the cave I go. Do I see iron? Not really. Coal, I'm not really after now. Ow. Ooh, iron. I gotta cross the, the abyss. Which I will just do right now. If I fall down there, I'm dead. Uh, let's see, down here down there oh I used up all my cobblestone really <laughs> only two iron <laughs> I think I have enough to make rails right but I need something to make a minecart <laughs> I almost forgot about that I'm doing this so I can get back up, not because I'm scared of falling. Okay. That's light. This is actually not that big. I thought it was a lot. Oh. Well, there's more up there. Okay, let's go. Into this cave. 
which I'm never going to return from. That's not that bad. Ooh. Look at this. Okay, I know iron's not going to be up there, so I'm going this way. Oh, look, I found some. So you need six iron to make a rail, I think. Yep, six iron and one stick. So I have enough to make a rail. And you need five to make a minecart. So I know I have enough right now. I think I have some at home. So this can be a little short mining excursion here. Look at that. Let's build to this. Ooh. I can't tell. This looks like it's bronze. And why am I <laughs> why am I hitting it with the hoe? Alright. Oh, it was copper or whatever. Same thing. I call it bronze. What do you guys call it? Okay, I'm not gonna go down there yet. I'm gonna go here. Up this little hill. Let's see. Oh, creeper. Okay, bye, bye, bye. I don't need to be up here. I've overextended my stay. Okay, we have enough iron. Let's go. I need to eat. <laughs> Do I need more coal? I might. Whatever. There's some up here, right? Ooh, there's a zombie. <laughs> Better not make him mad. I'm scared that there's gonna be like a zombie who's gonna come down on top of me or like a, a creeper. Cause that's not fun either if a creeper just comes on top of you. Or if I back into that zombie, that's not gonna be fun either. <laughs> okay, enough now. That's enough iron, or uh, that's enough coal to smelt the iron that I collected. Okay, down the hill. Ooh, I almost died there. So I'm not going to, of course, finish the trading hall today, but I'm going to set it up at least because it's going to take like hours to make. Where am I? Oh, I still got to go up this big hill and not burn myself. Let's see. Um, since I don't have cobblestone, the design is mostly going to be wood. So I'm going to have to collect just a bit more wood to make sure I have enough. And then let's smelt the iron. Okay. Oh, yeah, I came from the side. Perfect. Oh, I also have to have two spare iron to make uh, a shears. I think I have two in the chest right now. Oh, look, I found another cave. This one has a lot of coal and a lot of mobs. Don't want to go down there. So, one of these days, i got to go find a jungle temple. I mean, there's a lot of jungle around us. But it also makes the landscape pretty. Okay, keep forgetting. The door is on this side. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make my house a double house, you know, with the <laughs> with the door on each side. So no matter what direction I'm coming from, I can get in. Um. All right. Let's see. Don't know what I will need, so I'm just gonna take this and that. Why not? Um, I don't need that. I'll take this. Won't be wasting too much. You know what? I can make two furnaces. Just gonna make two furnaces. <laughs> I have two crafting tables. Why not two furnaces? 
Okay, this one here. Smelting that, and then that's going to go in afterwards. This one here. Smelting that. I'm going to keep this on me just in case I need to make more. Okay, put this stuff away. I don't need that. Ooh, iron. So, I need to make rails. And... Oh, <laughs> I need one more. I did not think through anything. And then a minecart. Okay, there's 16. Now I'm going to be using boats to get the villagers in the trading hall. And then once they're in the trading hall, then I'm going to be using minecarts to move them around. And there's a lot of things over there already, like a lectern and stuff. So I'm not worried about crafting any of that. Uh, there might be a blast furnace as well. I think I have enough torches. It's not like I'm lighting up the village or anything. And then hopefully I can find a pillager outpost so then I can get the effect, the bad omen, and I could potentially do a raid. Ooh, I'm also gonna wanna, I do gotta make a shears because I'm gonna also wanna, um, here, I have enough for the minecart. I'm also gonna wanna make a few beds so I can do like, um, I need sand as well, uh, so I can, um, oh, I'm losing my mind, <laughs> so I can breed them, uh, usually I might just make a small little room and I have the villagers breeding in there, and I might actually do that, but, like, it's a lot easier to trade with them if they're, like, organized in a, you know, in a system, like a villager hall, I only needed eight, but guess what? I'm not doing eight. I'm doing 32. <laughs> so this is glass so I can see when the villager baby is made. There. I can make shears. And I only need that much, really. I don't need much more sand here. In the site. Okay, I don't want to have too much extra stuff on me. I'll come back for that. I gotta shear my sheep. And, you know, sucks not having white dye. <laughs> How come there's not a white flower? I gotta breed them. I have plenty of um, resources for that. So I'm going to be making the beds out of, like, the black wool and the gray wool. Hey, look. They're all the same color sheep. Isn't this fantastic? Oh. Oh, I have enough. Okay. I was going to collect another one, but I have things I got to do. Ooh. Great. That's all I need. Okay. I'm leaving. Yep. Stay in there. Men over to the village. Now, what should I use? Um, I might use potatoes to breed them. So when I go over to the village again, I will bring my little hoe so I can make a little farm, you know? Glass, that's important. That's for my little farm. I have dirt, great. Um, two of those beds, one of these beds. I can always dye one of these. And then a white bed. Here. Oh, I don't want that. Three will get you 12. That's two, I think. No, 12 is exactly what I need. That's four. <laughs> Can't do math. Okay. And then do I want to make any certain table? Like a katak photography table I don't think it's needed 
All right, off to the village I go. I think I have extra boats I just laid on the ground there, so I might have a mob or two. Um, I'm just going to go this way. Too bad I didn't I didn't take a boat with me because I could use a boat to get over to the village. Instead, I'm going through the jungle, climbing up trees like Tarzan. Ooh, I can make cookies. That'll be fun. Right? You use uh, cocoa. A parrots. What do parrots like? They like seeds, right? Parrots like seeds. I can get a parrot or two. That'll be fun. There's the village. And there's all the horses. Here, let's get to shore. Wow. All right, we're at the village. Um, oh, the boats didn't capture anyone. So where should I make the villager trading hall? Should I just make it down here? Uh, where is it? Where do they put the one villager? Right here. I could literally just make the villager trading hall here. Like I could, in this extra space down here, I could make, um, you know, pillars and then fill up the above area with dirt the breeding thing could be, you know, instead of mining this entire space out in the ground, I could just do it like this. Do it in this little valley here. Here, let's capture another villager. Look at that. Points. Okay. I'm going to have to collect my Xbox points. There. He's in the boat. Now I hope he doesn't die because I kind of need him. Here. I can surround him. Put a little torch down here and surround him. No villagers shall die on my watch. Make a little roof over him. Only baby zombies can get to him now. Or skeletons. Either way, I hope that doesn't happen. <laughs> um. Alright. So... I kind of started mining out of space in here. I don't know. Do I? Because this is crooked, okay? If this was like a straight line, I wouldn't mind it. But I'm going to make it down here. Which requires a lot of mining. So let's get started. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Welcome back. Uh, so I collected a few villagers, as you can see. And all I need to do now is just put them in their respective areas. So first one here is minecart guy. He's going in there. And I'm gonna block him in there so then he doesn't escape, you know? Uh, you know? Goes someone over there. It's not dying? Okay, that's good. I don't want him to die. Okay, and then I do that. And then I just practically destroy. No, no, I hurt the villager. Mm. That's sad. Well, this guy will be a cartographer. <laughs> See, now everything's more expensive. Okay. That's all for him. Um, I can't move these people. Oh, I had to destroy the boat. So, because they're kind of in my way, 
I'm gonna destroy the boat. No. Okay. Well, uh, this guy is the next guy then. Um, I'm thinking about putting him in here. Um, do I have any easy blocks to work with? Okay. Well, this and that. Okay. So once I destroy this. do that okay that worked well now that he's in this area I can cut off this part so that once I just destroy that I wanted to make this guy library I'm not worried about the trades currently I'll go through all the trades later on because I don't know about that um, but right now, I just want to get the villagers in their respective spots. I'm going to later on make um, a, a breeder for villagers because I have a nitwit that's saved. And then there's other villagers. So for now, I'm not worried about that. Um, here, let's do this because the next set of people I only need this small arena for. No, I should not use an axe. Well, just get in a hole and let me see you seal you in it. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm injuring all these villagers. Um, Fletcher. I want to arrange these in a certain way, you know, but... Now the Fletcher's going in there. Uh, stupid villager running in the background kind of annoys me. Um, I don't know what. Fine, I'll do that. Okay, I'm gonna delete this with this. It'll take longer, but I don't want to hit the villager. Okay, there, I didn't hurt the villager. Can you just get in there? Okay, thanks. What? How is everything increasing? I didn't even hit him. Okay, well, guess who has this? I was gonna save this, but I just, I'm just gonna trade with him now. Because I feel like it. <laughs> Give me emeralds. Good stop being all sad. Yeah, he likes it. What a deal! Okay, I, yeah, I don't know if that was the best decision, but. Mm -hmm. Everyone else hates me. So. <laughs> oh, I was about to like catch him in there. Ugh. Yes, okay. I caught him in there. works okay that works great now that you're in there I'm gonna make you what a farmer or I, it's a cartographer there I'm gonna make you another cartographer just so I have the cartographers nearby okay thank you <laughs> for your hospitality <laughs> I may just do a breed room I'm just gonna collect a few villagers and put them into a little room where they will breed I think that's going to be a lot easier than what I've been doing. So, a breed room, and then if I wanted to take some, I can always take some. Um, or I could. I could make a breeder. I still have all the resources I need to make a little breeder. So, yeah, I'm just going to make a breeder. Um, so, yeah, until then, I'll just... All right. <clears throat> So, resuming right here, um, what we have currently is an open space, and we're going to have at least two of these breeding, and the rest are going to go down 
into this the village of Chenny. And so I'm gonna make a design or a previously design. Um, but anyways, <laughs> um, basically the kids are gonna fall down here. And so I want this dug out. Okay, it's not gonna be that bad. I thought it was gonna be a lot worse than what it actually is. Okay, all this is gonna be is we're gonna have. this and then we're just gonna have these two to stop the kids from running out um oof. and then that brings the kids right here so then i can easily take them out of there and ship them to where they're needed which is nice i should bring this down one over right bring it down one over i have that i can always move the fletcher okay we're good um yeah you we'll always edit it later as we need. And then, uh, once we're down here, we put this in the middle because the baby can still fall down there. And then the beds just go on top. Whoa, this is pretty low. I thought it was going to be a lot <laughs> higher up in the air. All right. That's nice. And then here. We don't need to do this, but I usually do this. I do this. This is supposed to keep them in here when they wake up. They stand on this the stick, you know. But usually they wake up and they're on the wrong side of the bed, let's say. Oof. Here, let's put that back. All right. And so I usually put this over each of the beds here so then they're forced to wake up on the right side of the bed right except i don't want them like waking up outside you know like outside outside and so i'm gonna have to like cover it up like this because that'll be awkward if they spawn like outside i gotta leave one some of these areas for feeding them Okay, and then I'm just going to take one up at a time. Literally right over here. Hoping to break the minecart so once it gets up here. Well, I guess that's fine too. I want to break the minecart and then they fall in there. You know? They're probably going to take some damage, but it's fine because these are the ones that I'm breeding. Okay? Okay. Doing this, I hope that I can. Sweet. Okay. Uh, I also don't want them coming over here. So I'm hoping that they spawn. Or are they... They're just going to go into another boat. Okay, I guess you're the first one then. I'm going to bring this guy back. So that he does not go to another boat. that It shouldn't be this hard. <laughs> Come on, pick him up. 
No, I brought him right back in the. Mm. <laughs> no, why do I have to be? No, then I entered the villager. Uh, experiencing difficulties. Get out. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. And then I bring them up this little hill. And then, ooh, I did not think through this part. Did he die? What? Oh, he's just down here. You need to get up in your hole. Come on. <laughs> this is the kind of stuff that villagers are just douche douchebags. They're so annoying to deal with. How? How? What? What's happening? What is happening? <laughs> what? It's fine. I had enough villagers, but like... What? Oh, he's asleep. Okay, good. I was so scared that I just killed the other one. <laughs> I, I, it, it, I just don't know what's happening. <laughs> what? <laughs> the wine cart picked up the boat. I'm so happy I got that on camera because otherwise I would have never believed it. Okay, I have one villager. Actually, if I just get another villager here to sleep in the bed, we're all good. Right? So, I just gotta get this villager to, to sleep in the bed. It's nighttime, so the villager should go straight to bed. Which is hopefully what's gonna happen. Get in there. Sleep. No. No. Don't go to the other boat. Sleep. <laughs> Good thing I'm catching this on camera, otherwise no one would ever believe this. <laughs> no. You go over there. There's a bed for you to sleep in. Why aren't you sleeping? There, good, finally. Okay, I have all the villagers I need sleeping, okay? So, I'm just gonna stop it here. Stop it here, okay. And then the other villager, I'm just gonna have... The other villager, I'm just gonna have... Um... I should put like a chop door up here or something. So then I could feed them better. Um... Can I can I catch the other villager on a rail? I don't kill it first. I'm gonna need that. Um, where's my mic card? Here, can I? Sweet. And I just need to bring him down here. Uh, mm, no, not that way. If I do that. Oh, whatever. <laughs> this is not the right way, but it's not a wrong way either, so I will get through it. And then down here, I'll go down and into the pit. 
here. I don't want him to suck either. There. It's a very long, tedious way, but he'll get down there. Um, for that. <laughs> it works. Great. Um, I'm just going to pick up these rails and move my ambitions down there because I don't have anything to feed them with yet, so I can't do anything for these people up here. You know what? I'm going to make a few torches because I don't think it's bright enough. I just don't want any mobs appearing. Okay. Delete these. Okay, how do I get past this guy? Where do I want him to go? He can... I'm gonna need another lectern. Let me go to the village. I know I have other things that can make him, but I wanna... I wanna use the lectern. Let's see, and then I'll just end it. Once I become a librarian, I'll worry about uh, changing them later. Just want to make this guy a librarian. And then I'll be done. Ah, uh, guess who needs to eat? Um, where was the library? It was over here, I think. It's over by the coast. This is not the coast. It was over there. <laughs> I think that building right there is a library. It's right next to this hole. Yep. I have enough wood so I can turn these all into bookshelves again. But for now, I need them. Yeah, let's go back down. So I call this a success. Building a village or trading hall. Uh, let's make this into, yep, the lectern. So requires this, that, and then that across, and this. Okay. Down you go into your little dungeon. Okay. Destroy these. Lock this off. Okay, all I need to do now is, um, yep, block them off. And destroy this without killing the villager. Okay, you get in there. No, you, I could use a water bucket. I might just have to. You're supposed to go down in the hole. Oh, is it not their trading time of day? Okay, well. I think that should be it for my video here. I did everything really I needed to do. I'm going to, like, trade off camera and everything. But, um, that's where I'm going to leave off today's video. Uh, thanks for watching.